Hello friends, my name is Rasa Masood. Today we will discuss about a topic, Scrum. Friend, today's topic is uh, very interesting and uh, very important with respect to project management. Uh, friend, if you are studying project management or uh, you are planning to give exam related to Scrum or Agile, so friend, you will definitely see this topic in the exam. And uh, this is a very, very important topic with, uh, with the reference to exam point of view. Your concept should be very clear about Scrum if you are if you want to clear the exam related to Agile or Scrum in the exam. Secondly, friend, uh, Scrum is a methodology used in software development for uh, managing the projects. So friend, if you are uh, already a professional project manager and working in any organization as a project manager, so your knowledge your concept should be very clear about scrum that how to use the scrum and what is the uh, methodology is and how it can be useful to successfully complete the complete the project so friend let's uh, start first of all i would request to please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you so let's uh, start scrum first of all friend see what is basically scrum Scrum basically friend uh, a methodology used in project management for managing the projects related to software development okay so uh, the scrum methodology a scrum framework basically it's based on agile methodology the what is now agile methodology agile is a methodology which is based on the incremental approach in which we basically collaborate with the customer and uh, collaboration among the team members is very good and based on that based on the collaboration with the team and with the customer we increment the project we increment the uh, things and after uh, with the collaboration with the coordination and uh, discussions with the customer we evaluate the product and after after evaluation and with the passage of time we deliver the things and cust uh, to the customer now what is the difference basically uh, agile and waterfall approach friends see in the waterfall approach what we do we uh, what we do we basically plan uh, and then we uh, plan develop test and then deliver this uh, at the time of deliver we at a once we deliver the things to customer however in in, in the agile approach what we do we incrementally uh, deliver the things incrementally things evaluate and uh, it is not the scenario that at once at once all the whole things will be delivered to customer with the passage of time we evaluate the things we evaluate the product and after evaluation it reached to some level which is acceptable to customer so this is the uh, agile approach agile is basically based on incremental approach like we increment the things we evaluate the things we improve the things things means project project deliverables so uh, at with the passage of time it becomes acceptable to customer and then we hand over it to the customer so this is the uh, concept of scrum now uh, uh, sorry this is the concept of agile agile is the incremental approach now coming towards our main topic scrum scrum is basically approach which is based on agile methodology now what is uh, what is basically the scrum scrum is an agile project methodology or framework used primarily for a software development project with the goal of developing new software capacity every 2 to 4 weeks now what what does it mean actually see friend this was just only a definition um, let me give you an example here let's assume that friend you are uh, implementing a project of e-commerce solution just take an example of e-commerce solution if we take the same example of uh, uh, the software development with waterfall approach what happened with the waterfall approach here see friend here in the waterfall approach what we do actually we uh, first of all we plan then develop then test and then deliver the things to customer so this is the approach of waterfall waterfall approach like first of all if you are implementing e-commerce solution what you do actually in the waterfall approach you will uh, plan then develop then test and then deliver to the customer however in the scrum approach it is it is a different approach because it is based on agile approach so what we do in agile uh, in in the scrum based approach what we do here comes the concept of a sprint here sprint is a three to four week time period 
in which we deliver the small or small chunks of things to customer let's assume that uh, the e-commerce solution has 40 tasks to deliver okay as a whole so if we go for with the waterfall approach what we do like we deliver all the 40 tasks at once to customer okay in the waterfall approach however in the uh, scrum approach it is a different approach what we do actually we basically do like uh, we uh, divide the 40 tasks into four sprints like each sprint will contain 10 tasks okay and every sprint will be contained of uh, uh, for example three to four four weeks time period so within four months we will complete all the uh, all the four sprints or all the 40 tasks so what happened actually uh, sprint based approach first we uh, plan develop test and deliver the first 10 tasks to customer and once we deliver it to the customer we get his feedback as well like he likes the approach he like our development or not if there is any mistakes so in the next release or in the next sprint we fix all those things so basically in the scrum the coordination with the customer coordination among the team member is very excellent is very good honestly saying it's very good due to which what happened actually uh, customer is also very happy because at a very early stage he gets something so that he can see something that it is working fine or not he can give his feedback as well however um, in the waterfall approach what happened like he has to wait around three to four months and once he release he see the release most probably the, it is not as up to his standards is up to his uh, uh, expectations so in the scrum what we do we divide the work in in a sprint based approach in sprint is a three to four week time box so uh, for example if there are 40 tasks so each sprint will contain 10 tasks okay and what we do like uh, we complete each sprint will contain the whole scenario like plan develop test and then deliver deliver it to the customer get his feedback if there is any problem issues in the release so we have to fix it in the next release okay then in the second sprint we do the same thing like plan develop test and then deliver to the customer then again get his feedback so here friend see what happened like in the scrum based approach what happened actually we are getting the feedback of customer at a very early stage and customer is also very happy what happened because he see he he is able to see the product at a very at a very early stage if there is any feedback is required if there is any incremental approach is required if there is any correction is required so he can give it at a very early stage of a project and team is also very happy because uh, the uh, reworking or the correction in the product is less because they do something less like for example only 10 tasks they do then uh, show it to the customer show customer see the product like e-commerce solution for example if the catalog is good if the functionality is good for example customer can do the payment through credit card or debit card etc etc so he can see the functionality at a very early stage uh, customer and he give feedback to team and team is also very happy because they are getting the feedback at, at a very early stage they have to do less reworking and they provide it to, it to the customer at a very early stage now friend uh, scrum in that manner basically we divide the work into multiple chunks and deliver it to the customer at a uh, you can say the elaborative manner incremental manner we provide it to the customer so uh, both uh, persons both are very happy like customer is also very happy the uh, uh, the customer is also very happy also the uh, the team is also very happy in that scenario so friend in that week scrum is nowadays very popular and very acceptable for the uh, for the team and the for the customer what are the benefits of scrum first of all productivity is very high quality standards are better because see less reworking is required uh, reduce time to market whenever we are giving things to market it reduces that our time uh, em employ or means customer satisfaction is very high because they are able to see the things at a very early stage team dynamics will be better because uh, team collaboration especially in the scrum framework team collaboration and team 
collaboration is very excellent uh, especially in this scrum framework employees are very happy why because uh, they know what they are doing they have some control on a project they also talking communicating with the customer and customer feedback they are receiving at a very early stage they are delivering good things so that's why employees are also very happy honestly saying i have my my own experience I have seen that normally generally i have seen that the workers or employees who are working in the scrim frameworks they are more happy this is my own uh, concept uh, my own thought okay friend uh, thank you thanks a lot for your time and uh, that's all for my side i hope you like this video if you like please share it with your friends and colleagues and thank you thanks a lot for your time